everyone is doing well. It is hot out here right now. Bro, I need one of them old church fans, you know, with the stick and then the paper piece of um, thick paper. I need one of those old church fans right now because uh -uh, it's 85 degrees. Who got time for that? Don't nobody got time for that. Uh -uh. You know, sometimes we do stuff so much it becomes a norm for us, right? It becomes a norm for us. And we don't realize that that's what's holding us back. When your normal ain't working, it's time to come up with a new norm, you know? But it's like, it's up to us to realize, you know what, what am I doing that's holding me back? It's up to us to realize, because sometimes we know, Sometimes we be knowing, we just don't want to change it, you know, but it legit be holding us back because we used to it. So it's like we just keep on at it because it's normal for us, but it's okay to develop new norms, you know, it's, it's, it's okay. It's like we have to make that decision to reflect every aspect of our life and see how we feel because our feelings let us know everything we need to know honestly your feelings if you think on something your feelings let you know how you feel about it you know so it's like just, if you just think on every aspect of your life see how you feel about it write it down, you will see the things that you need to change and what new norms that you need to create for those things that you need to change. You know what I mean? Like, it's crazy how that works, but it's dope. That is so dope. Like, our feelings let us know everything that we need to know. Like, legit. They let us know when you're feeling down about something. They let us know when we feeling we feeling I right with something. They let us know when we feel like we could do better with something or when we, you know, when we stagnant, when we feel like we progressing or we moving forward, you know what I mean? It lets us know everything. So just imagine if we was to actually write down how we feel about different aspects of our life so we can look at it. Sometimes you just gotta put the pen to the paper so you could just look at it and see what's going on and just dissect that thing. You know what I mean? Sometimes you just gotta dissect that thing. You know what I mean? And then once you actually see what's up, because sometimes it can go over our head, but once you see what's up with your life, then it's like, that's when you can just um, start imagining yourself doing better. Start writing out those goals that you wanna do to fix the issue, fix the problem or, or whatever it is. And it's like eventually, once you have those goals written out, once you know, you've been thinking on it and imagining on it, you know, believing in it and having faith in it, the manifestations start happening. They start coming. They start coming. Just out of nowhere, just start. Just, just, just hanging in your face. Just, dang. Ooh, dang. I ain't see that one come. Promise you the manifestations, the blessings just start. Ooh. Just hang in your face. Won't well, well, know where it came. Just came out of the blue. Just came out of the blue. It is okay. It's okay to make some new norms. I had to do that. I had to do that. And I'm so happy, you know, because of it. You know what I mean? Sometimes you just get, you get too, you get tired of being in the same spot that you've been in for a minute. You know what I mean? And it's like, I, it's time to stop. 
I need to start doing some dissecting, you know. Hand me my, my uh, what are we going to, uh, who would be using the dissect stuff? Hand me my, my skate scalpel, you know, and you start Look, you'll find out some stuff to see now. So, you know, it's okay to make new norms, guys. If you like this video, please comment, like, share, subscribe, and all that good jazz. Be blessed. Stay blessed.